Hey guys, uh, we're on Winding Rimlet. Yeah. We're uh, using worms. Just on the float account. Trying to still level it up to match rods. I know it's been a while since I uploaded, but... Had a lot of stuff happen. Get into all that, but I'm back. I'm gonna try to make some more videos. Level up this account. We're at the pond right now. We'll see how this goes. So far, we've done pretty well, float wise. We're still low level, but we'll get there. Just take time. Started this count forever ago. Just haven't had a chance to play on it again. But uh, I do want to finish the whole the leveling this account up. You know, get everything finished and hopefully get the carp on float rods. That seems super interesting. But our first goal is to get the match rods. The one on there. Got here. here. A little Chinese sleeper. One fish at a time. Bites are so quick in this pond. Oh, I thought he had that. I mean, it looked like he had it, right? See how he did it. But. Did not get the fish, so. No, we eventually need to get our um, bait making skill up. Our bait harvesting. We get the pearl barley and all that good stuff. I was going to live stream this, but then I thought, well, I haven't made a video in forever. I should go ahead and make a few videos before I start live, live streaming. Get back into the swing of things. Got a little nibble action going on here. I see that looked like, I mean, it looked like to me it was taking the bait. Line was going everything, but go to set the hook and no fish. Guess it's gonna take me a while to get used. Uh, uh, 
the mechanics a little bit here. And that one's on there. Marker and Gibble Cart. Thank you. These low levels, you just got to take what you can get, that's for sure. Thought that one was going to take off with it, but let it go. Uh oh, uh oh. Now, okay. <laughs> I guess I was a little too late on that one, wasn't I? Man. I thought for sure I would get that one. Make his mind up if he wants to take the bet or not, can he? There we go. We got him that time, didn't we? Get in here. There we go. A little bit bigger Chinese sleeper right there. I'm interested to see just how long it takes me doing nothing but float fishing without uh, premium and all that as just to uh you know see how long it takes and what we can manage to accomplish on this account perch right there because I have not done any other fishing this float I'm gonna have to eventually get started on that harvesting bait start making some bread and all that good stuff I'm really interested in Trying to catch bream with match rods. I mean, I caught a lot of bream on bottom, so I'm like really interested to see what it's like catching them with float. We gotta earn that money float fishing percentage up got a lot of work to do on this account a 
There we go. One marker perk. Looks like we might have one on this one. No, I don't mean. I thought that float was down, but that wasn't a good cast. Let's throw that out a little bit better than that. There we go. Seems like the bites come faster now than what they used to in this game on float. I know before you even set, I got a bunch of spoiled fish in my inventory. Uh, how am I keeping that here? Seems like before you would wait a lot longer before you'd get a bite. Huh? Seems like that's going to be a decent one for here. Perch. Got a float pony. 22.9. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. I got a new computer, a new mic, everything. So I hope the sound quality is a lot better. I know a few, I mean, in the past video said that my audio was cutting in and out. I got a arm for my mic, so hopefully that'll fix that problem. Uh, been trying to make a little bit other content other than RF4. I'm, I mean, I'm still going to make RF4 content, but... To share other games I'll play too. I mean, it just feels nice to be making videos again and be back on this game. I think we got one here. Yep. Yeah. I turned the background noise off because it was like a constant dog barking here. And I was like, well, who would want to listen to a dog bark nonstop? I went ahead and turned that a bit off and down. Then it makes the, the video a lot quieter. I don't know. Are you guys with me on that though? I mean, who wants to listen to a dog bark like... Every second. So far, so good, though. Well, oh, plenty of, uh, Worms, so 47 more of them. Here, once we go through those, we should have a little bit of silver to work with. On there, yeah. I don't, if anyone's got any tips on when to pull the rod on this that would be greatly appreciated because like to me the fish has got it on a lot of these and then i'll grab the rod and i'll yank it and they, no fish will be on there period so i mean you guys know a trick to it leave it in the comments below i'll definitely try it out And it's a lot different than fishing with feeder because feeder you just, I mean, you can just throw it out and just wait. You can even minimize the game and while you wait on a bite. But this is more attentive, like you, you gotta watch. 
I don't like that about it, honestly. Okay, I'm gonna have to slow my roll here a little bit. Give it time to actually take the bait. Oh my goodness. Am I snagged or is that a fish? I'm snagged on this one, aren't I? It ain't even moving. Oh, I done broke out on accident. We're down to two now. <laughs> oh, yeah, it was a snag, too. I figured it was. I don't know if I got another setup for that or not. Oh, yeah, okay, Lear. Oh, I guess I do. We'll go ahead and throw this one back out. A little action on this one. I see how it's down, right? This gets aggravating a little bit right there. To me, that was down and it was ready to go, man. Okay, that one's down. Uh, I'll see how. Maybe you just gotta wait for him to, you know. Take some slack out of line or something, maybe. We'll see. Try that and see what happens. Like he's nibbling it again. That one's got a fish on it. See, I gotta be more patient. Like, I'm... <laughs> I'm ready to go. <laughs> gotta slow down here.
There we go. We got that one. But that's a that's a horse right there. What's in here, horse? Twenty three percent. Let's go. Turn the old flashlight on here. Got one on this one too, boys. Let's go. Damn, Chinese sleeper, three hundred and two. How we roll? How it's done right there. <laughs> You know that one went uh, okay. Did we get a float point, Brad? Yeah, twenty-three points. Dude, we're on a roll. We are rolling right now, guys. We are getting it done. That is for sure. That one's laying down there. Oh. Well. Then, bitch. What? Come on now. This ain't right. Dumb me dirty there. Dumb me dirty. Again? Got me again? That one might be getting ready to go with the bait. Now, okay. Right, right. That one's definitely going to be on there. Oh, yeah. That's a little bit bigger here. What I'm talking about. Get in here, big boy. Get in here, big boy. 23.4. Um, 120 silver. We're doing all right. I mean, we're getting some markers. I mean, not huge fish, but it's a process. It's a process. Can't wait to go after Bream, though. I'm pretty excited about it. It's going to take some time to get all of this gear bought. Get our bait harvesting up. That guy's down. What? Come. Oh. Pinky little guy. -er. I haven't really fished this pond much. I kind of like it here, though. 
23.5. Oh. All righty then. <laughs> could have thought that I would have had that one. It was down and gone. I wonder if my hook size is too big or too small or something. I'm going to try switching the hook on this one and see what happens here. Let's put a... Uh, that might be too big, but let's try it out anyways. Let's try it out. Maybe we'll, uh, I just might be missing these because my hook size is too big. I mean, too small, maybe? What do I have on this one? Oh, I bet my hook size is too big. I don't know, though. I mean, it... I just don't know... What hook size you should use for his con. Uh, we'll try these mediums out and then keep a small on the other one. Fill it out from there. Trial and error. I'm learning as I'm going here on this float fishing. Too deep here. Go to 49. Like we got some kind of action going on. That one, I think this one is definitely too deep. Bring this one up too. That one is moving with bites. So, hmm. Okay, that one's got a fit. Yeah, I figured that one had a fish on it. It's a little big one. Here we go. Oh, we got our first bream. Nice. I didn't think you could catch them on in this pond. That is cool. The marker bream at that. That is excellent. I'll switch one of these over to bread to, you know, keep two different baits in the water. I want to pull this one so bad, but I don't know if it's really the fish is on there yet. I don't know. I don't think he is. He's just nibbling on it. Not really for sure here. Oh, 
Oh, he's got to be on there now, right? Yeah, there we go. Bam. Gibble cart. One's on here, too. No. Nope. Make this one a little shallower, too. Yeah. I want to try everything out. And I want to put red on this one. We got 167 bread. We started using up some of it. Maybe we'll get something different with the bread, you know? I might have to edit this video too. I haven't edited a video in forever. I'm going to get back at it though. This problem is that right out there is too. I wonder if we can we move to another location on this pond, or are we just stuck here? Let's see. We're just stuck here, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah. Sure does look that way, doesn't it? Wait, 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 wait. Hey, now. Maybe we should move over here, guys. Maybe we should move, like, right here. Right there. Give that a few minutes and see what happens. I mean, I mean, we're doing pretty decent here, though. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh. Oh. There we go. It's a horse right there. That was a pretty decent crewchin for our level, really. What skill percentage is match rods, anyways? Here, I get the well, I need it 30, but and that would let us use reels. I wonder if we could catch a bream with that. That'd be interesting. Match rod is 60. We might unlock this first, but I don't think we'll put any points into it. I'll have to get those points back when I reuse my free reset. But yeah, like, we get this here, then we use them up until that, because that's 30 to 60. We should be able to make a good bit of silver back. I would think, anyways. But really, what is up? Can't use the. I don't even know if I'm saying that right, but um, thirty-five. Okay, then at forty we can use a leader. First car brings at forty-five. Eight slingshot at 45. And the slider rig at 50. And then finally we get our match rod. Can't use the pop-up rig till 70. I've seen videos of people using this. This is really good. Can't wait to try that out either. And this, I mean, this is 
interesting right here. Soft lore and, and a lore. That sounds pretty good, doesn't it? Here we go. On marker. Turn the flashlight off. Anyone on there? Let's try that other spot over there for a little bit and see if we can't do any better. If not, then we'll come back here. Hey, we got one right here. What do we have here? Oh, that's a nice good one. Hey, I just want to try over here for a few minutes and see if uh, we do any better. I think we can get into the deeper water maybe from over here. Be lined up right. Let's see if we can do, drop it down. See if we can get there. Yeah, I think we can. I think we can, guys. Oh, come back in a little bit, didn't it? This one at like one. And keep this one at the same depth. Okay. Let's see how this goes in this new little spot here. Might not get nothing, honestly. Nothing yet. It looks like we got a little action over there on the first rod. Hmm. Went down. But there was not a fish on there. Okay. Hmm. Oh, we need to eat something. Forget which button it is to bring up the quick menu. What button was that? It's you. Okay. No. Been so long. That inventory. Quick food select. T. Okay. Pieces of. This. We'll eat that canned pork too. Oh yeah, that was good. I raised this up a good bit. Okay, I think it's definitely slower over here. Maybe we need to go a little deeper. Go 175. That does. If not, we'll go back to that other spot because we're doing pretty good there, honestly. I just wanted to try this out. You know what I mean? 
mix it up a little bit. Because we're going to be at this pond for a minute. I don't think this was going to work out at this spot here. Good one. That one that I put deeper. Maybe that's what we need to do on the other ones in this spot. Hmm. Well, now that one's getting a bite now too, and it ain't as deep, I don't think. That one went down. There we go. Seems like a bigger fish too. Oh, what is that? Crucian carp. Thirty-two experience points for that one. We will take it. One on here. Yeah, there's one on here now. Go. Twenty-three point six float fishing. There we go. Oh, this one's a little bigger. Uh-oh. Getting... Is that a tinch? Nice! M personal record. Maximum experience points awarded. Look at that. That's a nice fish for our level. Let's go. Oh my god. We got... We got, uh... Well, you want to let me put that rod down? That stinks. That was a nice fish, man. What did I catch that on? Worm? Hmm. I don't know if that was the worm or the bread. Oh, yeah, the bread's on that blue one in the. Yeah. I'd like to catch some more like that. I'd get us to level 10 a lot quicker. I think I'll put this one down to the depth of that one. I think I have one, what was it, 1.75? There we go. You made. Probably take the medium eight off this one. Put a smaller hook on this one because it's a weaker setup. I think we'll just go all worm because bread doesn't seem to be doing that great. Out right there. I'm gonna grab this one. We will switch this one to the medium eight. Worm on that one. And hopefully start getting a little bit bigger fish in this spot on these two real rods. And hopefully only the little ones will bite this one. 
that's the idea, but it usually don't work that way. Usually they'll go for your weakest setup. Or they used to. I don't know if they still do, but it just seemed like the bigger fish would always bite your weaker setup instead of your little bit stronger setup. There we go. Arc 23.9 float fishing. You're on fire right now. Definitely making progress. Zoom in so we can get a good look at these. See what we can get here again I can catch a couple more of those tench What do we got here? I was watching the other one and this one went down. Oh no. What? Hey, you guys seen that, right? That float was down. Like. A little aggravating when the floats down and you see it moving but then you go to pull it and maybe it's because i got medium mates on here and it's just a smaller fish though maybe that's what caused it you know this guy gonna do Other one's getting a bite now too. What's going to go down first is the question. Now the other one over there is getting a bite. Down, but it went right back up. So okay, this one's down. But there wasn't no fish on it. All right. <laughs> Sorry about that, but okay. Unless he released it by the time I grabbed it. I don't know. I don't understand it. Because that was a small hook, too, so. Yeah, I'm Hmm. How does it how to figure out those hook sets like when to see like now that's down. It would help if I grabbed the right rod. I see that was down. I, <laughs> hmm. That one's down. Back up. It's down. Okay, we got that one. Go. Nice. Uh, 
think he might be on there. No. We got here. Oh wow, okay. Nice. 24.1 float fishing. Got some really good experience for him too. I think there it's less bites but bigger fish over here. What it feels like. Found pretty quick right there. I think this one's on there. Or not. I mean <laughs> Okay. Now that one goes down. Well I got this one in my hand here. That one's on there. Another big boy right there. 24.2. Really nice experience on that one too. We're doing pretty well. Can't complain with all of this. Getting active in this spot pretty good too. I could just set the hook more often and not miss the fish. We'd do all right. Missed another one, man. Hmm. Got to work on my patience. Alright, let's see, let's see. What I'm doing here. I thought he was going to continue with it, but he didn't. I think this one's on there. Nope. Man. Here we go. Point three. Where is the raking in the flood experience today? That was a little guy right there.
fishies. Get in here. This is going to be a little bit longer video. I'll be surprised if anyone watches the whole thing. As long as it's going to be. You guys do watch the videos and like and comment and stuff. But it does help the channel out. Right, YouTube algorithm, you know. Even if you just let it play in the background, it helps out, you know. Thought I had that one. I didn't, though. That one on there? No. Ah, not for sure that one was. There we go. Another marker given. Action here. I got that one. He's a tiny guy, though. Isn't he? Yeah, a little. Got a float point out of him, though. 24.4. That's pretty decent there. Or just catching a bleat. I just don't know what he wants to do here. Hey, they're all getting nippled on, but not one has went down. Okay, this one just did. Oh, missed that one.
Missed that one too. Missing a lot of fish today. We're also catching a good bit though too. I thought for sure I had that one. What? Got that one. Sure got that one. I was quick on that one. Another Persian, 110 experience points. Liking it. I thought that one was down. There we go. Got them all back out again. There we go. There we go. It's down. Got him. Tiny sleeper, 24.5. Getting closer to 30, but I don't know if we'll have enough silver by the time we reach 30. Get it. Might be able to get one. That up, maybe. I don't know, because we'd have to buy a reel, too. I don't know if we'd have the silver for that because I'd like to buy a decent reel for it. So we gotta watch how we spend our silver because we also got to uh, raise our bait harvesting too. Crafting baits and everything so that way we got the bait the bream and stuff that will be uh a big thing getting the baits for the bream I was on my phone and missed that one. Thought I had that one. I hit the wrong button. I hate when I do that. There we go. I hear another marker Chinese sleeper. Getting into a different fish now, it seems like. Missed that one. Eat us a bite of bread here. Oh. 
Okay, it's at that time. Got him. Fish on, what is he? Little perch, but we did get some float fishing experience. One four seven. Fighting faster now. Where'd that fish get? There we go. A little crucian. Nothing special, but. Selling for silver, it all adds up. Every little bit's gonna help on our journey here. I thought I seen that go down. Oh. Okay. Okay. I missed that one for sure. Oh, I thought I had that one, but I guess the game thought different. <laughs> oh. Go, we got that one. Oh, my goodness, that is a big guy. Here, I'm gonna get in here, boy. Dream. Wow, personal record, biggest fish caught, personal record, the strongest fish caught. Let's go. Look at that. That is a nice fish for our level two. 24.8 float fishing, 307 experience points, 1.722 kilograms, 39 centimeters. Loving it. They've caught some pretty nice fish today out of this pond. Hmm. That 1.7, 1.4, that nice tinch. Excellent fishing today down here.
Gar nicht, gar nicht. Well, let's see. Two K more. What, like 2.5k more experience? Or four? Found in there. For level 10. I don't know if we'll get it before I have to end the video because this video is getting pretty long. I'll probably give it until dark and then we'll go see what we made and uh yeah see how much silver we made selling these see if there's any cafe orders that we can cash in on then sell the rest to the market see how much silver we made I mean we're getting closer to the 30 percentage for the felonies or odds and then but uh, I don't know if we'll have enough silver to actually do that and get a decent setup we may be at this pond for a while honestly we get the silver up to because I'd like my first setup to be a pretty decent setup So I went on there. Yep. Stuff. The creation. Minus these ones that. Guys. They're dead, dead. Ultra dead. You can't get dead than that. I mean, we've caught some. A lot of fish here. Oh, we got one on here? Yep. Another Chinese sleeper. I don't know if those Chinese sleepers start biting a lot. We might just stay a little bit longer. Little perch. We got some more float experience there. 24.9. Almost a 25. And this pond is great to get your points up really fast when you're just starting out, it seems like. Uh, I highly recommend fishing this little pond if you're going for um, um you know fuel experience which uh yeah it's pretty nice Maximum maximum total fish weight of fish caught in a day record. We've been on fire today, boys. We are rolling. Let's go. We got another one. Oh, we had that one. We was on a roll and I was just going with it, you know. Guess the flow is over there. <laughs> I 
Got one there. Another bleak. And then bleak, they give a good bit of experience. 399 for that little bleak. We might have to find us a bleak spot, boys, and fish some of those. I thought that looked pretty weird there. Might be a nice fish right here. Yeah, it is. Well, we're at 5.78k of 7.5k, so it's safe to say we probably ain't gonna get a level unless we catch some really nice fish in the next few minutes. But we did get our float fishing percentage up. So much today. Is that, is that one down? I don't know what I was thinking there. What's going on there? Yeah. It's that. Thought I had that one. Oh, for sure I had that one. Look at all these fish. Here we go. Our little perch. Got one here. Get a little bit bigger fish. In here, another marker. Any bit of silver we can get is going to help, that's for sure.
All right, so I'd like to at least hit 6k before I end the video. I I really hate that we haven't got level 10 yet, honestly, but. I guess we could go ahead and fish until morning. Maybe that'll give us enough time to get level 10, but once morning comes, I'm probably absolutely got to end the video because I think that would put over an hour, well over an hour. I think we'll get level 10 if I don't start hooking these fish. That's for sure. We need to get these fish hooked. Can't give up on some catches like that. These telescopic fives that we bought been putting in work we bought these on the last episode i did on this account ages ago i apologize for that but i had so much going on like didn't have the time real life you know we got a per chair I thought there was something on there. Well, it looks like the bites have slowed down completely, doesn't it, guys? We're up to 50 fish, but looks like our progress here has come to a halt. So I think we should just go ahead and call it and see what we got in the video here. Let's go see how much silver we make. See how well we did. It's gonna take so much silver to get the gear we need, especially all the cart gear. That's gonna be what costs the most. Getting those match rods, getting some decent reels for the match rods line carps bait and stuff we need some money now let's check the cafe i think we got that don't we i don't know if it'd be worth it though would it no we definitely got that go ahead and flip to sell those 
Oh, two. Two pieces. Read. Okay, so I have 6.73 silver. Well, our, our tent barely makes that for 13.98. Okay. We don't got enough bleach. Um... Go ahead and sell these non markers. Why ain't it letting me? There we go. There's another five silver. Definitely got the perch. Okay, there's another 8.68 .68 silver. We didn't catch no bream, no rough. Like I said, we don't got enough for the bleak. What about this bleak down here? Yeah, we don't got enough. We, we didn't catch that many bleak. We didn't catch no white bream. So that put us up from 120 to 154.68. What, like 30 silver right there? Something like that, anyways. Where am I going? Where am I going? Fish, yeah, there's a fish market. Okay, let's get rid of the rest of these. Which, that's more than what I thought we would get. Honestly, 47.57. That is decent money. For our level. That puts us up to 202. And I'm almost for sure we had 120 when we started. So what was that? Like 80, like 82 silver, something like that. I, I ain't very good at that, but like, uh, we made profit and we got plenty of bait left. Yeah, look at that 106 worms left i think next episode we'll also work on our uh harvesting baits a little bit start getting it up at least get it up to pearl barley is what i'd like to do and we might hunt down some bleak because they seem to give better experience better money so we'll try that out next video I really appreciate you guys watching this video. If you made it this far, uh, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I know everyone says it, but it really does help out YouTube algorithm. And uh, catch you in the next one, fellas. Later.